So here's how you could go about finding the solution. We'll tag the roads with the weight that they hold. And we see that if we take any weight in a tree that is in equilibrium and we go up, these numbers double every time. Why do they double? Because if you look at the rod, it will be in equilibrium if this weight equals this weight. And so this one has to be double this one. So we can take each weight in the original tree, like this tree, and see if this one remains unchanged, what would be the weight of the whole tree? And it will be 3 times 2 times 2. In this case, 12. We do that for every weight, and that gives us what the weight of the whole tree should be if one of the hanging weights doesn't change. Let's see exactly what we mean. So in the original problem statement, we had 3, 7, and 6. So we would list 3 times 2 to the power 2 equals 12. 7 times 2 to the power 2 equals uh, 28, I think. And 6 times 2 equals 12. Then we see which number of course most often and we say, okay, so we can make this a balance tree of weights 12 and keep this weight and this weight unchanged. And that tells us how many others we need to change. So we just do this, we see which number occurs most often, and then the answer is the count of the ones that do not equal 12. That's all.